my friends, a secret method of hip escapement that you haven't seen before. Watch this. I'm in a situation where my opponent just took me down, he scored at me, and he doesn't want me to get up. I'm sure so many of you have been here. Regular hip escaping is not working. Hands, here's what I'm going to do. I'm pressing his head down to me, making sure recognizing where his eyes at. I'm opening my legs, and unlike regular hip escape, where we have to use one or two feet on the ground, I'm going to keep my feet in the air, and I'm going to use the strength, the strike of my hamstrings on his quads to lift my hips one side and strike to the other side. This gets my hips to this side, gives me a good angle to start working. I cannot wait over here because if my opponent has somewhat of understanding of grappling, he will be covering my hips. Hands, from this position, I'm reaching over to capture his lap muscles and pull them to me. I'm opening my hand and slicing around to my elbow and extend. Very important for you not to try to bring it here because it's an easy access for your opponent to trap your arm. Opening the hand, slicing it on your elbow, extend fingers pointed away from your opponent. Most likely, one of the variations your opponent will take from here is going to reach for that arm, and that's a trap that we're going to use. The moment I sense he's reaching for that arm, I post my legs, and I thrust as hard as I can in a similar mechanics of a Kimura sweep. Most likely, my opponent will post his arm, and that's the time when I'm letting the lat go, switch it to the modified wizard, where it's not a pulling wizard, but it's a pushing wizard in this fashion. This gives me a chance to take my leg out, turn my hips, and put tremendous pressure on my opponent's shoulder. From here, I decide to get into the control, into the headlock, or go around and work from the back of my opponent. 